Hello, welcome back to my channel. Anyways, I am going to tape. Is this gonna work? All right, I'm gonna tape this camera down to my dash so that you guys won't go anywhere. Today is in fact the big day. It's the big holiday, you know, the holiday that means the most, that everyone enjoys, and that is probably the most pointless holiday of all time. Yay, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day sucks, honestly. And it's not that I'm bitter because I am single, because that is not it at all, because I love being single. Being single is awesome because you are independent and you can make your own decisions and you don't have to worry about anyone else and like depend on anyone else or compromise with anyone else like that. So you're on your own. And being on your own on Valentine's Day is even better. Valentine's Day is the day of love, right? Right everyone? Yeah, day of love. And if you don't have anyone to love, actually you should love yourself more than you ever can love anyone else. So you can celebrate that. And by celebrating that, you can go out to eat with yourself. And going out to eat by yourself is way more fun than going out to eat with someone else, especially a date or your boyfriend. But then, if you go by yourself, you don't have to compromise on where you're going or decide where you're going. You can pick wherever you wanna go or what movie you're gonna go watch because you can do whatever you want, which is awesome. So, right now, it is not even Valentine's Day. <laughs> it is the day before Valentine's Day, but I decided that I wanted to record this before Valentine's Day so that you guys can watch it on Valentine's Day. I said Valentine's Day like a million times in the past three sentences. So I am just driving and I have cheer practice at four and it is what, 2.58. So we're all kind of on a time crunch to do all of our Valentine's Day activities. Okay, now I need to untape this and we can go inside. I am at Walmart. I'm at the sketchy Walmart also. Um, this one's just kind of closer to my house than the other one. I don't know why I came to this one. I came to this one mostly because I wouldn't know anyone in here, I don't think. Probably. I'm probably going to know people in here. And I didn't think it'd be as busy, but it's definitely as busy. So, lose-lose situation. We're going in anyways. Yep. You know what day it is. Okay, so this is what I got at Walmart. It says, Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, thank you. Let's open them up and do a little taste test. See if these chocolates are worth the pricey value that they were. Okay, so we got a... <laughs> All right, so we got a good setup. We got um, five chocolates here and Let's just taste each of them. Um, this kind, this is awful. I hate this kind. Strawberry. We're gonna try the next one. This one hopefully will be a little better. I don't know, we're just gonna try it anyways. Oh my God, this is orange. I don't want anyone to buy me chocolates for Valentine's Day. Not even myself, this is disgusting. I'm not done yet. I'm still gonna try all of them. I'm not even gonna look at the flavors because I just like to take chances, you know? Okay, this one's good. Okay, um, this one is like a little swirly boob looking thing. So I'm gonna try this one. Mmm, this one's good. Caramel. Last swirly boob looking thing. This one's probably caramel too. Taste, they all kind of taste the same except for the two nasty strawberry orange ones, which I don't think anyone likes. So why the heck would they put those in these Valentine's Day boxes. So the moral of this story is that most chocolate heart boxes suck. I mean, I paid a dollar for this, so maybe that's why. 
maybe if your girl's worth a little more than that, you could spend the big bucks on her orange strawberry chocolate. But we're done with that. Okay, so I was just thinking, what better way to celebrate Valentine's Day than to make Valentine's? Mm -hmm. So I came to the great Dollar Tree to buy some very pricey items to make Valentine's for somebody. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know who, but I'm going to make some Valentine's. I got all the supplies that I needed to make these valentines. I'll do a little haul in case you didn't get everything. I got these um, flowers. I don't even know why I got these. But I just thought they looked cute and very realistic. And they were a dollar, so. Next thing I got were index cards, which is what I'm going to use to write my valentines on. I needed tape to tape these kisses on. Valentine's Day used to be super fun when you were little and you had those parties, you know? You'd have um, the Valentine's Day parties in school and all of your little friends would give you Valentine's and you would make your own and then put them in your little homemade boxes that you'd make in class and art. It was just, it was just a fun time. I didn't buy pre-made Valentine's because that's just not as cool, you know? It's just dumb. You want to make your own Valentine's. So, on this Valentine, I don't know, what should I write? I'm gonna write, Happy Valentine's Day, you big turd. If you were to lay in my yard, my cat would try to bury you. Boom. Happy Valentine's Day, you big turd. If you were to lay in my yard, my cat would try to bury you. Awesome. Let's see. Let's write. I hope your Valentine's Day is filled with strawberry and orange cream chocolates. Okay. Oh, I forgot to sign my name. Heart Emma. Um, next one, I'm going to write, I would love to punch you in the face. With my lips. All right, so that's enough Valentine's for today. Now I have to go to cheer practice, so that is it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it, and I hope none of you got orange or strawberry cream filled chocolates or flowers that looked like this, because if you did, you know they're from the Dollar Tree. Have a great Valentine's Day, and thanks for watching.